वेलकम एवरी वन दिस इंटरेस्टिंग क्वेश्चन वॉज आज इन इंटरनेशनल मैथ ओलम्पियाड नाइनटीन एटी फाइव हियर द क्वेश्चन लैंग्वेज इज चेंज स्लाइटली बट द मेन एसेंस ऑफ द क्वेश्चन रिमेन सेम गिवन टू अर्स इज ए बी सी डी इज अ साइक्लिक क्वाड्रिलेटरल विद लेंथ ऑफ ए डी एंड सी बी एज एट एंड फाइव सेंटीमीटर इट हैज अ सेमी सर्कल इंस्क्राइब्ड इन इट एज शोन विद दिस गिवन डाटा वी हैव टू फाइंड द लेंथ ऑफ लाइन सेगमेंट ए बी लेट चेक द सोल्यूशन लेट स्टार्ट बाई टेकिंग अ पॉइंट ई ऑन द लाइन ए बी सर्च दैट द लेंथ ए ई इज एट सेंटीमीटर नाउ लेट्स जॉइन डी ई सो दिस ट्राइंगल ए डी ई इज एन आई सॉसलेस ट्राइंगल सो इफ दिस एंगल हियर इज एल्फा डिग्रीज दैन दिस एंगल डी दैट विल बी एल्फा एंड दिस एंगल हियर by angle sum property this angle will be 180 minus 2 alpha now full quadrilateral abcd it's a cyclic quadrilateral and thus opposite angles are supplementary and we can say here the angle c that will be 2 alpha now from point c two tangents are drawn cd and cb and by theorem we can say that the line joining oc will bisect this angle or this individual angle here will be alpha degrees now if we'll join do now if we'll take do as a chord then it's subtending alpha degree at point c and alpha degree at point e and by theorem we can say that your ceod is a cyclic quadrilateral now here if i'll take this angle as beta degree by theorem the and uh, exterior angle of cyclic quadrilateral is equals to interior opposite angle so here this angle that will also be beta degree now again from point d two tangents are drawn so that is da and dc and by theorem if we'll join from center o to point d it will bisect this angle so here if this angle is beta degree then this remaining angle that will also be beta degree now again coming back to this uh, cyclic quadrilateral we know that opposite angles are supplementary so here if angle d is 2 beta how about angle b yes angle b will be 180 minus 2 beta degrees now in triangle ceb if we'll see here so by angle sum property we can say that angle c will be nothing but beta degree and this triangle ceb is an isosceles triangle and thus the length be will be same as bc or 5 cm and thus the full length ab full length ab will be nothing but 8 plus 5 or 13 cm this question actually was asked in other form to prove that the line segment ab is ad plus bc but personally i like uh, questions more to find the values rather than to prove them i hope you enjoyed the solution i will see you in next video Till then tata bye bye